What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? How are you doing today? I hope you're excited because today we're ripping into another box of 2022 CHL, and I think this is one of the most underrated products on the market right now. As you can see, uh, this box costs 110 Canadian plus tax, but you can definitely find them for 100 bucks plus tax. Uh, just this is the one at my local hobby shop, and I wanted to open it right away before the NHL draft. And that's the big thing with this product, the CHL stuff. Uh, it's before the draft because everything Connor Bedard in here is worth money. If you pull any sort of Connor Bedard, even a base card, like I'll throw up his base card on screen now, the recent eBay sales, it sells for 100 bucks. So if you get a base card of Connor Bedard right now, it sells for 100 bucks. So I wanted to try and get another one. I've been one box of this stuff before on the channel, so I'll leave a card up to it in the top right uh, if you guys want to check that out. We did pull some nice Bedard stuff, and hopefully we can today. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, because if we hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of August, we will do a massive giveaway, and you don't want to miss that. Uh, drop a like on this video, help me reach a wider audience. Make sure you follow us over on whatnot on Instagram at Arc Sports Cards and comment down below uh, if you've ripped open any CHL. This is probably my last hobby box because I think once the draft happens and he starts getting Blackhawks cards, this stuff will start to go down. So, yeah, let's see if we can get any Connor Bedard CHL cards. Last time I opened this, I had a lot of fun because basically in any pack, uh, just you can just get a Connor Bedard base card and it'll pay for your box. So I decided to pick up another one. We'll see how we do. All right, first pack, you either get one auto a box or one auto every other box. I can't remember. And I think you get an acetate card every box. So we'll see if we can find a Connor Bedard. Uh, I got to look through all the base here. I'll go a little faster for that, further through the box. Uh, we got star rookie of David Goyette. We got a CHL Profiles of Nathan Goche, if I said that right. Uh, oh, oh, not the right Pat. <laughs> That's the goaltender there. Uh, yeah, we'll go a little faster. Just look for the Pat's logo. That's all we really care about. I do follow the CHL, but I won't know all these players, obviously, because uh, there is a lot of players in this checklist. Uh, let's take a look here, see if we can find a Connor Bedard hiding. Uh, looks like we got one of these. This is a next step of Wyatt Johnson, who's been playing the playoffs for the Dallas Stars, who they're playing right now at the time of this recording. We'll see if they can survive game four. And then we also got an Owen Peterson. Uh, I might skipped by a rookie card. I'll have to go back and find that. Yes, I did. I skipped by our star rookie of Panophimus. All right, let's find this Bedard. Anything Bedard. Come on. Looking for the Pats logo. Let's see. Uh, we got, uh, got a CHL profiles there, Marcus Vitacek, if I said that right, and also skip by the star rookie again, Paul Ludwinski, if I said that right, and it doesn't look like we got any Bedard. Come on, Connor, I know you're in here somewhere, I just want to see a nice, oh, we got something shiny, might be our number, uh, one of our numbered cards, or an auto or something, Connor Bedard auto will be absolutely huge, I'll have to wait and see though, uh, what we got, so this here, or star rookie Shane Wright, that might have a little bit of value, probably not a ton. Uh, oh, this is one of these prominent or first draft picks. Quinton Musty, OHL priority selection. He's supposed to be a first round pick in this upcoming draft. I do know who Musty is, and yeah, no Bedard in that pack. But a star rookie of Shane Wright is nice. Okay, hopefully we can get at least one card of Bedard. So if not, uh, you're probably not getting a whole lot, to be honest. Uh, what we got? Oh, star rookie there, Callum Ritchie, also supposed to go f in the first round of this year's draft. And we also got a star rookie of Zach Benson, who's a potential top 10 pick. Uh, I'm, not sure, I'm not sure what the difference is. Maybe it's a retro star rookie of some kind. Uh, yeah, nice Zach Benson there. I'll take that. And there's no Bedard in the rest of that pack. All right, pack number six, and we got something red, something shiny. It looks different. Uh, okay, we'll see what we got. Uh, any Pats? Uh, I've seen these cards before. I forget what they're called. Uh, what do we got? Got a star rookie here of Carrie Terrace. Terrence, sorry. And we got a red first draft of Ethan Medema uh, out of 99. I didn't even see that. Okay. Nice low numbered card there out of 99. I'm not sh sure who uh, this guy is. Yeah, I'm not too sure. Uh, I'm not too familiar with this player. Uh, it says he's a center. I'll have to do some research on him, see if he's any good. Decent pull there. Officially halfway through now, no base cards of Bedard. I do think it is a short print. I'm not sure how short of a print. 
because uh, it is a base card. <laughs> But we will keep carrying on here. It looks like I'm going to... Oh, not that one. This one's our star rookie. Star rookie of Cam Allen. He's probably going to go in the second round of this year's draft. Defenseman there. And we got a first draft there of Matthew Cataford. And yeah, not too familiar with him either. There's a Logan Morrison. Uh, and no Bedard. Hey, but we're still alive because... Get a Bedard in any pack at any time. Come on. Let's see something. Let's see something. I uh, got a red. I think this just means it's numbered. Looks like the Ice Dogs. Who's on the Ice Dogs? I don't know who that is. It is numbered out of 100 of Rodwin Dynico. Okay, not familiar with him. And I think I skipped by our star rookie once again. Yep, Gavin Hayes there. And another numbered to 100 card, but not a great one. Running out of packs here, so hopefully we can see one. Please, just one. That's all I ask. One Connor Bedard. Looking for the Pats. Uh, we got an Acetate coming up. An Acetate Bedard would be very nice. Doesn't look like it, though. Got a star rookie there of Ben Bajold. And it looks like a Sudbury Wolf. Who's on Sudbury? Oh, wait, what? Star rookie Alex uh, Farron. Uh, looks like he used to play for <laughs> Hamilton. I don't like how they do that. Um, nice Acetate card there. So, we probably won't get anything too high-end of Bedard unless it's an auto, but nice acetate there, former Bulldog. All right, we got three packs left. We need to see something here, something. Uh, star rookie, Hunter Height. Uh, I've heard of him before, and we also got a star rookie of Tristan Leno. And I'm guessing no Bedard, nope. Down to it now. We haven't got an auto. I think they're in every other box. They're not in every box. So, oh, I, th I saw the Pats. <laughs> got excited, but wrong team. Uh, CHL profiles coming up. Star rookie of Dylan McKinnon. Uh, that's kind of weird. He plays for Halifax. Wonder if he's related to Nate. And we got a CHL profiles of Gavin Hayes. And hopefully there's a Bedard in our last pack, but it's not looking good. Also, the thing with these boxes, if you don't get Bedard, not a whole lot of value at all. So hopefully there's a Bedard in this pack. If not, we're probably taking an L. Uh, come on, let's see Connor. Uh, we even have an auto? I don't know. We haven't got an auto. Uh, Colton Dock there. It's kind of neat. Regina. Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like we will get a Mr. Bedard. Stars there of Josh Bloom. Star rookie of Delic. And, yep, no Bedard. So, yeah, rough box. I said rough box, but it's probably just an average box because we did get some nice stuff. We got the Zach Benson and the Callum Ritchie there. The Shane Wright stars. And we got two cards numbered, one number to 99 and one number to 100. So that probably makes up for the auto we, we missed and a, an acetate card as well. So we got good cards, just not the guys we're looking for. I'm not sure if this would even sell for anything. Probably not. It, I just realized it's a stars card. It's not even a star rookie. So, yeah, overall, not a great box. But if you do hit anything Connor Bedard, it automatically pretty much pays for your box so yeah overall not great we'll get them next time thank you all so much for watching today's video make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the next one take care everyone have a good one